After you've changed your gradebook to a weighted gradebook, you'll most likely see a set of messages at the top of the gradebook. These messages give you an idea of the areas that need to be fixed to make sure the weighted gradebook is set up properly. There are some settings you'll need to set on, the ca on each category because each grade item has its own weight that contributes to the overall score for the category. So you click on the Grades tab on the nav bar. This will take you into the Manage Grades area. You're going to click on the context menu next to the category item you wish to modify the settings. So you're going to have to do this on each one. You'll notice that you'll see some notes up here and as you set up your gradebook, weighted gradebook correctly, those will go away. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the quizzes and click on the context menu and click on edit grade item. <clears throat> I'm going to change the weight for this category. So I want to make sure that each one of these add up to 100%. Then you have an area called the distribution method, and there are three choices here. Manually assign the weight to items in the category. Don't ever choose this. Distribute the weights by points across all items in the category. You'll use this choice if the grade items within the category have different point values. Distribute weight evenly across all items. You'll use this choice if the grade items within the category have the same point value. So for this one with quizzes, I know that all of my quizzes have the same point value. So I'm going to use distribute weight evenly across all items. Once I do that, I'm going to click save and close. And then you'll notice that the weights on each one of these become the same. So each one of these assignments is now going to contribute the same weight, uh, the same amount for this particular category. Now in the homework category, notice I have one homework worth 50, one worth 50, I'm sorry, one worth 30, one worth 20, and one worth 25. So I have different point values. So again, I'm going to click on the context menu and edit grade item because I have to repeat this for each one. I'm going to choose 20% for this. And in this particular case, I'm going to distribute the weights by points across all items in the category. And then I'm going to click Save and Close. What this will do is you'll see you'll have different weights depending on the amount of, amount of points for each of those grade items. Now I'm going to finish that up and you'll notice that each one of these now items up here in these notes are going away. So I'm going to go to here, go to exams, and I'm going to go, this is worth 50%, and I'm going to distribute weight evenly across. I'm going to click save and close, and notice that all of my notes up top are now gone. That means that my gradebook is set up properly and it will calculate the final calculated grade correctly.